Hi, I'm Chris from Windows, and hey, you can do this. And that might not sound like a whole bunch because they have to turn it on. This is Air Windows Why Not Notch. Now you might well ask why why not notch or you could ask why not why not notch why not oh, we can go on and do that forever let's actually talk some sense here this is the final update that i've got for the y series which were initially control smoothed and i was asked to do a version of them where the uh, control smoothing was not in place causing it in certain situations to have more of a zipper noise kind of quality because people were using that creatively and uh, creatively is all good so what i was thinking is let's do a little rough example of what this thing is about since it's a notch filter it's not as easy to hear as some of the other ones. Plus, if you're using this resonate control, that's going to make it be much uh, wider of a notch or much narrower. As you can hear, we can use this to notch out pretty much the entire mid range. And then we can turn around and just use the skin control in the middle here to make it be a lot louder anyhow. Because the notch filter is going to take away what is it is tuned to. But remember the Y-series filters has this thing called a res edge control. And that's going to take things and make them a little bit weirder. That stops it from being as normal of an effect. So we start getting the edge that the res edge control is all about. And it makes it a air windows weird notch filter where you can kind of dial in some strange things. Oh, indeed, here we go. Hold the output level down a little bit. Why not notch is maybe a little more difficult for me to demonstrate on just random drum tracks. Like even if I pick a bit where it's not as much of a waste of time. I know. That's good. Let's isolate it to that horrible drum fill just for fun. And if I manage to do that. or even slightly do that. Bear with me. You can hear sort of an effect out of it. Notice as the resonance increases, it's pretty much doing a weird thing because we have res edge turned all the way up, but it's a notch filter, so it's letting through lows and highs and distorting both of those things. But the way that the filter interacts with it is heavily modified by res edge, and you make weird, strange sounds like this. Is that 
away. At which point, the resonance becomes so tight that we're not hearing it anymore. Unless, we start bringing in res edge. That's just obnoxious. I'll stop doing it. So, why not notch is for, hang on, I'm putting away my headphones. There we go. Why not notch is for you to use. And the reason I'm putting this out now, after I have recently put out uh, console MC, then console MD, which is the basier follow-up to it, then clear coat. We're coming up on a sort of big marketing and sales time of the year, namely, you know, Thanksgiving and Black Friday and a bunch of hypey things that people do around that kind of stuff. And so the way that I'm going to deal with that is make a simpler, shorter video of just sort of an update to a plugin and then kind of stay out of your way for a while. Not for long. I'm still going to put out a plug-in next week, but I'm thinking that's going to be probably my update to Subtite and the update to Console MC because I think I found a way, as is heard in ClearCode, to improve that algorithm without fundamentally changing the way that it works at normal speed. Like I think the algorithm is kicking in harder at the higher sample rates I like to use. And I think I can make that adjustment and have it be a uh, update in place. So Subtite and Console MC will get that update. And then you re-download it and use what the, the main form of that plugin is going forward. I'll rename the original downloads as uh, Console MC Original, Subtite Original, so that if you do need to have access to the way it was as it came out, then you can download those alternate versions and use those instead. But they're going to use the same plugin IDs. It's going to be a drop it in and directly use it. And any, any projects you've got with that stuff in there will load up the updated versions. And with a bit of luck, that'll make it a little bit more flexible, a little more easy to use, and will adapt better to what I was trying to get out of those things. That said, I'm going, like I said, I'm going to kind of get out of the way and not make a big noise around Black. I can't really do sales for Black Friday. Like if you already didn't join my Patreon, by all means, don't join my Patreon twice. For Black Friday, and that is the biggest sale I can give you, which doesn't really count for very much. I can give you something else, though, seeing as I just did a video about a weird little Minecraft thing that I put together. I'll probably spend a little time on that. I, a lot of the guys that I like watching, like I follow some politics on YouTube and stuff, and a fair number of the folks that I like uh, following there are... Um, left-wing, Ukraine-friendly um, debate guys. And uh, they do a lot of talking about things while playing video games. And I can kill some time playing video games, but I'm setting it up especially so that I can just talk to people, answer questions about plugins, stuff like that. But who knows? Maybe I'll have thoughts on some things. There are some very inter interesting things going on at the moment. Like, you may or may not have heard, but... Um, this guy, Sam Elman, just got uh, fired from the uh, company OpenAI. And it's a very weird, unexpected move. And I have some interesting theories about what those people might have been thinking and what he might have been up to. 
for that to be the thing that the board thought needed to happen in the weird and sudden way that they they ended up doing it. But that would be for another stream. Because I'm going to take it to about 10 minutes for this video. And I hope you enjoy uh, Why Not Notch. If not, uh, don't use it, I guess. And I will get back to working on the big, fancy, important things I've got going. But for the next week or so, up to and through Thanksgiving, by all means, pay attention to other people who are making a big fuss about Black Friday or whatever, because I'm not going to do any of that. I am just going to, I don't know, sit around, maybe stream a little bit of Minecraft, talk to people, and uh, get ready to code some more things. In particular, I do hope that I can give you something really cool for the Christmas season, holidays, whatever of those you like or don't like. And with that, I'll talk to you later. Bye-bye.